Seeing how Marvel Midnight Suns is about to release by the time of recording this video in about... Um, when, I mean, when is it coming out again? Oh shit. Well, I have decided to come up with a video and check out three Marvel games that were unfortunately cancelled in the past. If you enjoyed this video, subscribe and let's get on with the first one, that being Marvel Chaos, a 3D arena fighter game developed by one of the best, some consider to be their favorite gaming company, EA Chicago. What the fuck? Marvel Chaos was going for a more comic style graphics, as you can see here, where you will be able to play as multiple Marvel heroes and villains. Um. From the gameplay, it features destructible environments, which is awesome, seeing how two players get to destroy an entire city. And each hero had some special abilities to them, like how Spider Man could actually use his web sling to move across the city, so you know that character would have been broken from the beginning. And it had different game modes, like this What If mode, inspired from the What If comic. Okay, so everything was looking good, right? No, unfortunately no. The game seemed like it had multiple severe quality issues during its development in 2007, which was one year before the release of Iron Man, the movie. But months later, something happened to the company. Can you guess what happened? Give yourself a pat in the back, EA shut down that specific company and with that Marvel Chaos was no more. In the end we might never know how Marvel Chaos would have turned out, but by the gameplay here it reminded me of another PlayStation 2 title that I will say at the end of this video. Marvel 2099 is a side-scroller 2D action game developed by Safari, I mean Sapphire, for the PlayStation and PC. Marvel 2099 was going to feature again multiple Marvel characters, but the special thing about this one is that you were going to play as the 2099 versions of them so yeah the cooler versions and during 1996 they released multiple cd demos that were shipped with magazines wait a minute not those Yes, these are the ones. And it was featured at E3 1996 as it featured a level playing as the Punisher as you can clearly see here. Years later during an interview with the executive producer for the game, he stated that the game before cancellation was less than 50% finished. And during development, at first they were aiming for a fully 3D environment and characters. But after having some difficulties with development, they decided to go with a 2D environment but stick with the 3D character models. He also said that the game would have succeeded if they were were able to finish it. In the end we won't be able to know as that is just a prediction. And lastly we have the Avengers video game developed by THQ Australia. This was a first person called beat em up slash shooter game where it was initially planned to be released alongside the 2012 Avengers movie but it wasn't going to be related to the movie as this features a different story. A story that would have taken some elements from the Secret Invasions comics making it a complete original story. Players different Marvel heroes each having different abilities and ways to play them, like Iron Man flying around, or Thor throwing his hammer and summoning lightning towards enemies. There were even some enemies that would have had superpowers similar to other Marvel characters like the Fantastic Four or the X-Men, and you could play online and offline. So what happened? Well, because of financial problems in 2011, the studio was forced to close down, and then the license was auctioned off to Ubisoft, who later did Avengers Battle for Earth, which was more of a fighting game that one, but it was still related to the Secret Invasion storyline. And those are three cancelled Marvel games that we will never get to play. Out of these three, Marvel Chaos is one that I would have loved to play, seeing how it looked really similar to Godzilla Unleashed, which was a 3D arena fighter game. I hope you enjoyed this one, and now you may leave this video. Oh wait, and please don't forget to